All right, you guys, I just came across a really beautiful snake out here. And if he's still out here, I want you guys to see him. I've never seen one with patterns this way. It was like a brown. Oh, here, look, there he is. Yay. Okay, so he's like brown on top. But then on the sides, you guys, look. He's got this like beautiful black and yellow striping. Hi, buddy. I'm not going to hurt you. I just want to see your pretty face. Look at how beautiful he is. Look at how beautiful. I've never seen one like this. It's like, it's almost like this beautiful silky color brown. Hi, buddy. Hi, I'm sorry. I know I'm scaring you. Oops. I almost stepped in a hole. We have... I guess there's gophers or something. You see all these big holes in the yard? I'm always falling in holes. Kira always yells at me because when we play Minecraft, I fall in holes too. Oh, I scared him. Hi. Look at it. It's got a, like a pointy nose. I'm freaking him out. I'm sorry. I can't help it. He's just so pretty. I'm loving the stripes on the side. I wish I knew what kind of snake he was. If I knew what kind of snake he was, I would have picked him up already. I know he's not venomous, but either way, you never you never can be too safe when it comes to snakes, and I didn't want to get bit by him. Now, if it was a corn snake, I would have already grabbed it. Look how pretty he is. I can't get over this shiny color. I wonder what he looks like underneath. Oh, he's like a yellow underneath, you guys. Oh, you can't see it because I'm looking at him. I'm sorry. He's like a yellowish, orangish color underneath. Can you see that? Oh, you're so pretty. Oh, he's going to go hiding from me now. He's definitely not a baby. Depending what he is, he's small, but he looks pretty fat, so I would say he's older. Babies are usually really thin, so he might actually be full grown for whatever snake he is or she. I'm gonna have to look you up. Go on one of the Florida forums and find out about what you are because you're so pretty. Too bad you don't need ants unless you're in the house. See, this stuff right here, this fascinates me. I could be out here all day, all day looking for the snake. I actually ran inside to go get my phone and was hoping that he was still out here when I came out because a lot of times when... You spook a snake, usually they take off. But he stuck around. He was actually in the same general area. I was quite surprised. Oh, he's really going in there now. Can you guys see him digging in the wall? <laughs> he's like really hiding. See his tail? There's his head. There's the dogs next door. Oh my gosh, I can't get over how pretty he is. Oh, now you can't see his face. He found a bushel. I still know you're there, buddy. You're not hiding from me. Try not to move my hands too much. This fascinates me, you guys. This is one of the reasons why I don't think I can move out of Florida. I love wildlife way too much. So beautiful. This is just in my backyard. I don't even have to go to a place, to a, a zoo to see snakes outside. I can just walk outside. There's always snakes outside in Florida. Always makes me sad when I see people killing them. They're actually so good for the environment, you guys. They get rid of rodents and they get rid of like all the, the animals that have diseases and stuff. Especially black snakes. If you see a black snake, do not kill it. Black snakes actually kill the venomous snakes. So they're really good to have around. I'm, I'm really curious to see what kind of snake this is. 
He's like really trying to hide from me right now. Can you guys still see him? He's literally, let's see if I can zoom in. He is like, I am getting away from this crazy lady. Never had a human pay this much attention to you, have you? They probably see you and run. Not me. I saw you and ran inside to get my camera. And then I ran back out. I still see you. He is like in the grass. You guys, this is why it's so hard to see snakes outside. See... If I didn't, if I wasn't used to seeing snakes, I could totally step on him. Look, look at how he just blends in. You wouldn't even see him. Like if he wasn't moving right now, if he was just still, you would have totally stepped on him and probably got bit because, you know, you would probably would have hurt him. But I don't think he's venomous. So what kind of shoes should you not wear in Florida? Flip flops. What kind of shoes do I always wear in Florida? Flip flops. <laughs> With my one painted toenail. Pretty sad, huh? He's like taking off. He's like, I am getting away. I still see you, dude. Ah, oh, this is so awesome, you guys. I'm so, so excited. I really wish my husband Johnny was here. Because this is one reason. Oh, I, I actually lost him. There he is. This is one of the things that actually caused us to fall in love is animals. And I love the fact that him and I share the same passion for animals because there's so many people out there that just want to kill these animals. Like they just see a snake and they just want to kill it. And I hate that. Like I absolutely hate that. And I love the fact that Johnny loves wildlife as much as we do. He would be grabbing it right now. I tell you that. He would have grabbed it and had it up on his camera and we would have been touching it. But see, because I'm not sure what kind of snake it is, I'm... I'm 98% sure that it's not venomous because it doesn't have any of the normal signs of a venomous snake. But either way, because I'm unsure, I'm not going to touch it. I'd rather be safe than sorry. <laughs> I am freaking him out. All right. I think I'm going to let him go. He's found a nice place underneath the tree. Oh, look at him. I can't stand it. I can't stop. I can't stop recording, you guys. It's just so cute. Look at how pretty his sides are. Do you see that? Oh, my God. He's so pretty. It's like a little zebra. I can't zoom in close enough. It's going to get blurry. Oh, totally stoked right now. You know what? Thank you so much, little snake, for letting me see you and all your beauty. You have a great night. I'm going to go inside.